Hey everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man 2 for the Mega Man Anniversary Collection. Last time we defeated Metal Man and this time we're going to go after Bubble Man. Yay, Bubble Man. Alright, so first thing we're going to have to deal with are these frog guys. Um, so the trick to these guys is... Um, as long as there's a frog on the screen, the big frog won't spit out new ones at you. Wah. Get out of here, frog. I don't like you. These platforms drop as soon as you stand on them, so jump off them as soon as you touch them. You should be fine. These guys, you can shoot off their shells, but their shells do still do damage to you. So I just kind of try and ignore them. Okay. And now, of course, what would a water stage be like without um, spikes? Well, we'll get our first taste of Metal Blade here. And you'll see just how overpowered it can be. These shrimp things take three regular Mega Buster hits. Metal Blade, they're down in one. I'll take that. I'll take that. Now, I know a lot of people don't like water stages, but I do. I tend to like water stages. It's ice stages that I hate. And we get a one-up. Hooray. Ah, be careful of the spikes. And there we go. The interesting to note, those angler fish that were spitting out the shrimp, if you die and have to go back in the stage, but you've already defeated that angler fish, it doesn't come back. Once it's gone, it's gone. Okay, and get rid of those frogs. Refills. Oh gosh, that was close. So now I'm going to switch back to my regular gun. Now these crabs are actually a really good um, way to refill your energy. <coughs> Just remember that they always alternate between dropping in front of you and dropping behind you. So when you're ready to move on, what you want to do as soon as I'm ready to move on which I'm not ready to move on yet come on drop some health I said you guys were good sources of health and energy and stuff you're just giving me weapon energy okay I'm done with you guys so yeah as I was saying just wait for the one in front of you to drop then move forward while the one behind you comes down and you'll be fine and here we go on to bubble man who is weak to the metal blade and be careful I you know that was kinda silly of me to jump through there you don't want to jump through there because you might get a little upward momentum and hit those spikes but you know you can see how strong the metal blades are they just totally wasted bubble man there and he's done and for beating bubble man we get the bubble lead which is a very important weapon we'll talk about that when we get to it but this has been let's play mega man two on the Mega Man anniversary so I kind of forgot what I was going to say there for a second but um, Bubble Man's done I'll see you for the next episode